some people like really easy to update uh, or like some people really hurt like he mad that he America uh, family or different country family like uh, just he just scary kind of thing he just kind of scary All right, you guys. Um, last night I posted our temple video, and I just wanted to say everybody has been. I was really nervous, honestly, because you know, I know how it goes. But everybody has been so so nice, and it just makes me feel so grateful to have such a loving YouTube family. And I love you guys. Um, I just feel like when we have that sort of love and acceptance and tolerance for each other, like to together we can make the world a better place. So that's really cheesy sounding, but I'm really feeling the love. So thanks everybody for being so supportive. It's morning on our second travel day on our way to Florida. It feels like it's June 1st. It feels like it's June 1st, yeah, because it's pretty warm out. Uh, is it February? Yeah. No, is it? Who cares? I don't know. Mom, I think it's still January, I'm but um. Mom, there's a mom. What? September. Yeah, Peter's not feeling well, so he's just having some saltines for breakfast. But yeah, saltines. So we're hitting him up with the oils. Peter, how he should be. What? But anyways, so I don't know. It's sometimes it's hard for me to vlog these travel days because it's us driving, pulling in, eating dinner. I mean, so. Do you know? We'll see if we can vlog today. Does anybody want to vlog? I'll vlog. I'll Actually, vlog. No, I'm just sitting in the front, ain't I? Um, you'll vlog, Jude? Yeah. What we'll vlog? <laughs> that what means block? like film and tell the story of your day. Do you want to do that, Daniel? No. Nah. Daniel, Why you don't like you? being on camera, huh? Maybe later. You don't really like it when I film you, huh? Yeah. <laughs> so, I don't know, maybe I can convince one of the kids. I think Asher would do it, huh, Ash? Mommy. No, I would do it. Mom! You two want to vlog your day and tell us about what you do? Mommy? Yeah? They're not gonna be using Nikki's phone, but part of the time I'm not. Mommy? Yeah? That's my spot. Uh, I need to sit next to Angel. Uh, Are you wearing a Mickey Mouse shirt? Huh? Are you wearing a Mickey Mouse shirt? Yeah. Are we gonna see Mickey Mouse next week? Huh? At Disney World? What? Yes, we are. No! Yeah, we are. No, 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 no! <laughs> I can't believe mm -hmm. that. No, no, we're acting. Right. Hi guys, I'm Daniel Norp and uh, I'm 15 years old. Uh, I'm adopted in, uh, I think, 14 months ago. And, uh, uh, and my favorite stuff to do is cooking and eating. And uh, my favorite food is Chinese food because I'm Chinese and uh, um, I'm adopted. I can already say that, right, Mom? Yeah, you. Yeah. I'm. Yeah. Uh, what, was, uh, what was it like to be adopted at 14? Um, I adopted. I was like 13, almost turned 14. This one more, like one more week, turned 14, and then. Uh, uh, first, I saw my dad, like kind of, you know, weird. Just, uh, like, uh, look weird, like have big beard and uh, everything. is different than Chinese people. And uh, we, I don't, I don't know how to talk to her. You know, not really good English. And uh, then a couple weeks later, I think one or two, two weeks later, I, I saw, I'm, uh, I'm, I saw, I see my mom, and uh, just do it, mom do it, different thing, uh, like a hug, high five, kids, a lot, you know, and uh, so different than Chinese people, just feel weird, you know, and. Uh, the everything just feel different than Chinese, like, uh, kind of scary, and uh, 
I, I saw a picture of a lot of kids, like, tell me, almost eight, because they don't have an Eve picture. And um, it's feel uh, scary and uh, different and weird. Like, uh, you know, this thing about they can uh, uh, really like me or they gonna really nice to me and uh, do I gonna uh, really feed this like uh, this family it's all everything we don't know this feels and I don't know just scary you know that's it nah. yeah and uh, I, before I adopted uh, my orphanage uh, ask me, uh, do I want to adopt this? Do I, I want me adopt this because you know, first feel like uh, I like to go different stuff and I like to have family. And um, second, some people say this maybe easy have job, easy care himself. It's, you know, it's everything. This is want to be adopt this. That's it. I think adopted is a pretty uh, sometimes pretty easy. Like uh, some people, like a little to stop it. No more. Like a like some little baby. They he don't have parents. It's so easy adopted because he don't know everything or she. You know, like some some people older like me like have. He can choice like um, that kind of hurt. Like some people scary, maybe do something wrong. Like a uh, uh, or like uh, a yeah, he is not really nice or he's scary. You know, everything just different. Like some people like really easy to update. Uh, or like some people really hurt. Like he mad that he America uh, family or different country family. Like, uh, just he just scary kind of thing. He just kind of scary. Or like um, sometimes he wanna go back to his house, like go back to China or go back like a uh, uh, go back to some like a different country, like where he adopted. Maybe he like uh, eat some uh, like a uh, uh, he country food or just everything. He just wanna scary or he wanna go back the. Um, what about you? Or what? I, I kind of sometimes want to go back to China because like uh, you know I have a lot of friends like a long time now so you kind of sad you know and uh, I think we going to go to China because we traveling country and uh, maybe next year or this year I mean start traveling this world whole world right Awesome. Um, so what are we doing today? Um, what are we today doing is uh, we start go Florida. Um, this is our second day traveling. Go to Florida, and uh, we go. Why we go Florida? Because we, we want to go Harry Potter land and uh, Disney World and the Lego land. It's all stuff. I think uh, this almost every little kids want to go, right? That's all, that's, that's why we go Florida. So and what then, do you usually do in the car? Driving? We, we driving usually in the car, like sometimes we can have so like a iPad, computer, and then uh, like just have screen, have a, like a watch some video and uh, play game. Sometimes we have no game, we can just listen music or book or just sit in there watch window outside. Some pretty beautiful. Pretty good. And then uh, or we can just uh talking and uh, us we uh, some people uh, our family some people uh 
have game board for Christmas, like me. Like a, have a game board, we can play game board game in class. Game board. Atari, you want to show them? Yeah, I can show them. Look, this game oh, thing. Games. Have a have bunch of games here. I think I have 60 games, 70 games, right? Have 60 games. Pretty, pretty fun. And we just play with it. And that's, Mommy. I think almost everything what Mommy. we can do. I like to sometimes uh, bring Mommy. guitar in the track or band, play with it. That's all, or we bring some snack to eat. All done, Mom. Thanks, Here. Oh no, wait, I was that. I won three times. I only have this much car, Mom. Yeah, so yeah. we've stopped for only lunch. This much. And Pearl and Daniel have to finish their Uno I won game. three rounds. Really mm, quick. Good job. I'm gonna win. See, I have that much car. Oh. He have, have that many. Sometimes in Uno, though, you only have one card, and then all of a sudden you have like 20 cards. Yeah. Okay, I four. figured out why, um, oh, yeah. Skip. Mm -hmm. Skip. Yeah. Mom, I figured out why I think that I do that thing where I don't tell anyone. Okay, so we're done eating lunch. Get your snacks if you want any in the car. I want all the snacks. You want all the snacks? Then go get all the snacks. Today we're going to be in four states. Whoa. Whoa. We started in Louisiana, going through, we're in Mississippi right now, we're going to go to Alabama, and then we're going to get into Florida. Alabama! That's the most states in one day, I think. And yet it took four days to get across Texas. <laughs> yeah. Thank, Wait, it did? For being so huge. Mm -hmm. So, we um, saw here at the rest stop where we stopped in Mississippi that there's a NASA uh, had one of NASA's headquarters is next door and has like a visitor center so we decided to there's no reason to hurry just to sit at our RV park this afternoon so we're gonna head over to NASA yeah NASA see, here we come watch out see what that's all about hi y'all infinity entrance Hello. that's the entrance to infinity Hello. well uh, what I read is that this is a facility where they like test the rocket engines. Oh. So they have actual launching pads somewhere around here. You can yeah. take a bus to see them. Oh, that's cool. cool. Rockets are on the other side. Everyone's feeling pretty impressed so far. Well, there's that big, huge like, rocket engine. The huge rocket engine thing over there. What? Is that your keys? Oh, my goodness. Okay. Okay, here's the rocket. Here's an H1 rocket engine. These are actually which, really you know, impressive, even to me who I don't care about rockets. I don't care about rockets, but you that can't is impressive. can't deny it. that's pretty cool.
wanted to do a flight simulator. The theater was super cool and inspiring. Thank you. Oh, one minute. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Convinced we should be the astronauts. Yeah, so. yeah, I don't think I can be an astronaut. <laughs> I guess she's way too motion sick. <laughs> And um, it's a little later than we usually arrive because we went to that museum. So now uh, mom's, uh, we could go out to eat, but that gets old. And so I'm just trying to figure something out, getting the Instant Pot out because it's so fast and easy. My cooking has changed a lot since we got in the RV. Whoa, the cord was stuck. And I've just had to learn how to make things with electricity quickly with few ingredients that are healthy enough. So then I get in here, it looks like this. See that? And, and then I come over here and I push the button to extend. I don't extend both sides right away because Mike's working over there. But I can get in the kitchen at least. I'm gonna look through the fridge and see what I can pull together. So I got out a ham that I bought at Costco. It's pre-cooked, sliced it up. Threw some agave and some holidays for my friends. I'll put a link down below, some of their seasonings. Threw it in the Instant Pot for eight minutes. Now I'm just gonna make some potatoes and we're gonna call it good. You know, I don't know. I think it'll taste good. I don't know how healthy it'll be. 